Hi. <laughs> I'm gonna start therapy again next uh, couple weeks from, couple weeks from now, and we're gonna have to have the conversation about how things have been going with emotional overwhelm. I don't even think dysregulation is the right term anymore. Um, I do deal with emotional dysregulation, but that's more like. I mean, I'll have like a triggered eye kind of know how to deal with it, like um, breathing and stuff and uh, shaking and dancing. Maybe this is a good sign. Maybe I've been healing some from my triggers and my emotional dysregulation because I think that the trigger that I have been experiencing the most was basically um, fear of abandonment, right? But then once I kind of take that away, I still am dealing with the emotional overwhelm. Um, and just sensory overwhelm. They basically were saying they, they don't think they can actually see me that night. And then I just started bawling for the next out for the next like four hours. I had meetings to go to. I had, I mean, not meetings with other people, but like I needed to go to some informational meetings about classes. I couldn't do anything but cry and try to self-regulate. And I did. And by the end I was feeling connected to them again. And That was just, I can't live like that. <laughs> like I can't live like that. Like I, uh. Um, so not to put the car before the horse, but I did just interview again for peer support specialist full-time position. They might just already tell me no because they already inter interviewed me for this position and we figured out the timing wasn't gonna work. Probably not gonna be able to do this next semester. So I'm probably gonna need to like, mm, I need to apply the phone. Wah! I don't want to. I want to start now. And that's not gonna work, so. I'm gonna have to knock that. But it's okay. Hitting the point in the semester where, and in my cycle, <laughs> where I am, my body is calling to me to be kinder, dropping into and exploring my femininity, um, 
and I notice my body calling out to me to give it nourishing food and water and exercise and unplugging from social media and really deepening into what the goddess is asking for me which is a lot of exercise and food and things I haven't been able to prioritize. If you have a relationship with the goddess or you've ever saw her you may recognize that there are things that when you drop into your body there's and you drop into the trust of her and the trust of your body's needs it, it's like a trust fall and a beautiful one or maybe you have felt that in any religion um, and you kind of stop needing outward validation or when I do have triggers come up based on like people pleasing or what my partner's going to think about something I really can release that <laughs> when I'm in that feminine place because I'm in this place of trusting her and then I, that means that I trust what is what is. I also know that's going to mean I have fewer spoons and resources for forcing things. Um, my son to go vote today, which I almost, I almost forgot to do, but some youth were campaigning on campus about voting and it reminded me just how important it is. And I almost forgot that the democratic election uh, for the primaries is coming up is today and I really want Marianne Williamson to win and I feel like the people that are aligned with her are actually going to have trouble he knowing that she's in the race making it to the polls because she's really about she is about holistic governance and she's about listening to speaking of listening to your body listening to the earth listening to how do we care for this ecosystem and this economy in a holistic way how are we considering every element and not just putting band-aids over things so that's interestingly kind of what i've been dealing with in my life over the past few days and over the last full moon um, how do i create a more sustainable life and one where i trust in my fellow humans and in my partners and my friends and my ecosystem to support a holistic nourished life so i'm gonna go vote even though i'm feeling kind of soupy i see my grandparents in a little bit here drinking plenty of water and worshiping don't forget to vote i know it's a little late but please do Please tell me I need to be 